Okay, so we're testing acceleration rates with the same stroke length to see how it affects putter speed and ultimately the distance the ball is going to roll. Alright, so what do we got first? This is going to be, going to be high rotation. Correct. All right, and you can see he's got the stroke length marked 10 inches back, 10 inches forward. Try to make them consistent. Oh, so you we're can gonna see. Try to make the back length consistent. Yeah, so we're going to make the back swing length consistent. So this is low rotation. That ball would have went another six inches, probably wouldn't hit the wall. Yeah, so I mean you're you're looking at gosh, another I would say 30 inches difference between low rotation and high rotation. Yeah, come over here and show them which the yeah, which definitely proves our point that high rotation rates need to have shorter strokes. Yes, yeah, so you can see very that's a good job there, Vando. Alright, so that's the Average, right? Give me Correct. the give me the single so I can show them the difference. All right, so low low rotation was two degrees per second closing, super low, and then the high. The high was 54.1 degrees per second closing. So that's a pretty big dispersion. Same stroke length, like I said, 30 plus inches difference. So what do you think? We've definitely proved that theory. Getting there. Got to be a Got to be some correlation, right? Definitely. Definitely.